Are you tired of tossing your empty detergent bottles? Today we are going to be turning them into some garden gold. How our detergent bottles can be repurposed for various gardening tasks. In today's video, I am going to show you how we can do it. And so guys, the first thing I want to show you is my mini watering station made from detergent bottles. So whenever I am in this area, I just simply come and press this section right here. I get my water in my little watering jug that I can then use to water my strawberry plant right here. And if I have anything else planted in the planters, I will be able to water them as well. Now, moving on to the next thing.
I have used the bottom section of my jug to make a planter, I am going to be utilizing the top section because after a while, this part is going to get bad. So what I did guys, I cut off this section and now I'm going to show you how I'm going to be reusing this part. So guys, here is my watering jug. I am going to be utilizing this part of the bottle as a funnel. So I do not want any of my water to waste. What I do, I can either push, no, it cannot go under there, but I can actually set it like this, turn the pipe on. That way I can pull my water easily in the jug without any of the water wasting or spilling over. Because sometimes if the water force, if the water is coming out a little bit coarser, it can, you know, waste. So I prefer to use this to pull the water jug. All right, so the next thing that I am going to do is... So here is what I did, guys. I cut this side and this side from another bottle. I was about to do that one, but I just remembered that I did one a few minutes ago. And I'm actually using this bottle because this one cannot pump the water anymore. I could actually use it for um, a growing container like I did the one just now. But right now, I actually need some markers to put in my containers to remember whatever I plant in my pots. So here is what I'm gonna do. I will actually use a piece of tape. Tape it onto this. What I normally do in the past is to write on this part but I realize that whenever I do this, sometimes I want to reuse the marker. And because um, stuff is already written on it, I am not able to get the permanent marker off. So, I am going to be redoing the Scarlet Kale sign. So the seeds on November 18th. going to be here's my sign and of course I am going to be putting it over here and if I sowed any more seeds in this section I am going to be adding another piece of um, tape to write whatever I am going to sow in this um, container right here and so I am just going to be adding these yellow markers in the containers and whenever I come out so any seeds, all I have to do is just to put the piece of tape on it and write whatever seeds that was sown in this area. And I'm going to make one for all of these containers right here. So I have um, four more containers. All right, guys. So another thing you can actually do from your detergent bottle is to make scoops. This is one that I made in the past. And if you'd like, you can also go ahead and make a longer one by cutting off this section cutting off this bottom part here let me see if i can do it it might be a little bit challenging but it's worth a try i don't know where my working table is guys all i know is i i came back from jamaica and it was missing
And these type of bottles, they are not easy to cut. I prefer to use the um, prefer to use a knife. But I think you all get the picture, right, guys? And be very careful when you're cutting this thing. <laughs> this is very hard. All right, so I am gonna go and do it, and come right back and show it to you, guys. Honestly. It is really hard to cut this part of the bottle. I might have to go and plug in my saw. And for the sake of time, I don't want to do that. So what you can actually do is to cut this side right here. You can either shape it right here. At the bottom, you put it in a half a circle, you cut it off, and then you can have another scoop to scoop up your soil in your garden. All right. So by following these simple steps, you can transform your detergent bottles into everyday valuable gardening tools, reducing waste and creating a more sustainable garden. And remember, we can also save a lot of money. So now, what are some other ways you can repurpose plastic bottles in your garden? Have you tried using recycled materials for gardening? What was your experience? And what other household items have you ever used in your garden? So until next time, happy gardening as you continue to utilize your resources around you.